Welcome back to BNN Channel 9 News. I'm Delaney Wall. And I'm Annabeth Wood. And today is Thursday, February 24th, National Chili Day. Now for news. Today for lunch, we will have a chicken patty sandwich or a grilled cheese sandwich paired with ranchero, pinto beans, and crispy tater tots. The boys wrestling team competed in the sectional tournament at Hendersonville High School, and these are the results. Alex Velasquez placed fourth in 126 weight class. Anthony Pyron placed first in 170 weight class. William Zerniak placed fourth in 182 weight class. Wade Savage placed second in heavyweight. All of these wrestlers will be competing in the state tournament starting today and continuing until Saturday. The tournament will be held at the Williamson County Ag Expo. Come out and support your Bears. We'll be back after these announcements. Today's FFA dress up day is blue and gold. You will see many FFA members wearing their FFA official dress today. Many of our FFA members will be traveling to the state capitol today to meet with our state legislators and representatives. This afternoon at 4.30, we will have our FFA chapter meeting. We hope all FFA members attend this meeting to celebrate National FFA Week. Tomorrow's dress up day is chapter t-shirts. Historically black colleges or universities, commonly known as HBCUs, are institutions of higher education to educate black students. They were founded in the early 1800s since people of color were not allowed to attend white institutions. Currently, there are 107 in the United States. Notable HBCU graduates include the late Chadwick Boseman and current Vice President Kamala Harris, who both attended Howard University, and Oprah Winfrey, who attended Tennessee State University. Hey MJ, there will be a Interact meeting in room V119 today after school at 345. Hope to see you guys there. Art club is the club after school on Wednesdays in my classroom, A146, where um, students that either like art or want to um, hone in on their art skills and their um, creativity and build portfolios can come together. You don't have to be good at art, um, but just have some kind of appreciation. Being able to do more art shows or things in the community, um, that's a huge goal that we have. We are currently working on a mural for um, the theater classroom, and we did work on a project with criminal justice with the Valentines, and we do have the senior painted parking spaces coming up. But being able to have more opportunities out in the community, um, that's a huge goal that we have, getting our students out um, doing commissions and just getting their name out there. Um, my goal for my the atmosphere and art club at just my classroom in general is just a a safe space where people can come and just feel like they can be themselves, feel like they are not going to be judged, safe to be yourself, safe to express yourself. Yeah. Want to join art club? Um, the remind code is outside my classroom, A146. A representative from the University of Alabama will visit the MJHS cafeteria during all three lunch periods on March 23rd. The Lady Bears basketball team will be competing in the regional tournament versus Gallatin at Hendersonville High tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Come out and support your Lady Bears. Thank you for watching BNN Channel 9 News. I'm Delaney Wall. And I'm Annabeth Wood. And we're in touch. So you're in touch. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day MJ. MJ.